Hi guys, I'm Tendi. Welcome to PNP Beauty Salon. This is where the magic happens. <laughs> I'm a full-time BCom accounting student at UJ and on the side I sell Brazilian hair. My hair bundles, what I can say is that they are Brazilian. They are really, really nice quality or well, great quality. I sell them at an affordable price. Yeah, if you have to compare it with other places, I think it's quite affordable. They're durable. They, yeah. Regarding the market, when I started it was dead like super dead now <laughs> yeah. i even thought yo i'm just gonna have so many wigs for myself because it wasn't pushing but now it's really growing like by the week it's really really pushing now i see my business growing like i'm trying to build an empire guys <laughs> but really okay i want to like i don't want to just sell um just one bundle to this customer I see myself in the long run as now a distributor. I want people to come and buy from me wholesale, if I can put it that way. I want to have shops where you can come buy hair or you can come and just get yourself a wig or install your hair and leave. I'm trying my best to balance um, my studying and my business, right? But sometimes one needs, demands more attention from me than the other one. Studying though is my top priority and I must say like what I'm studying, accounting, is really helping me regarding the financial side of my business. You know like many businesses sometimes they just fail because you get money, you spend it, you're not seeing your costs, your profits, you know, so it's really helping me regarding my business. I'd say my number one challenge now when I, my very first time going to stock here, you know when you're in a foreign country, they don't speak English. I can't speak their language. <laughs> it was a nightmare, believe me. And yeah, but currently my challenge is basically, it's just, I'd say just keeping my clients happy because some customers, some are demanding, some are very nice. <laughs> so yeah, that's my biggest challenge at the moment. The greatest piece of advice I received. I'd say number one was I was taught I was told to be patient. And right now that's really what I'm trying to do. <laughs> yeah. You know, when you just deal with everyday people, they need patience. You're not always going to understand each other. And I deal with total strangers most of the time. So that is what's really helping me. Patience. Yeah.